so today we are going to clean the Time Masters deck out because uh, I remember I said last video that uh, the backyard was super tall and I mulched it uh, so all that grass is up in here uh, and I always use a plastic scraper if you use metal it's going to scrape underneath it scrape off paint so you use, always use a plastic scraper so this is pretty thick right, right in here that's super thick I'm really shocked it still cuts as well it does with the deck being this full. Uh, I need to power wash it too, but I think I'm just going to clean the deck out now, get all the grass out. I like to wait till it dries a little bit because if it's still wet after you cut the grass, it's a giant huge mess. So I just want to rake it off when it's dry and just uh, throw it in the garbage can. So that's kind of what I do. I'll set you up here and uh, let's get to scraping. side shooter down to the ground that's where you want to tip it all right so you guys know Alright folks, I got probably 98% of it out. Uh, you see the big pile right here. Here's my pile. So this is way too much. Uh, don't ever get let it get this bad. Uh, just harder to clean out. Uh, but definitely wait till it's dry. And then when I flip it back over, uh, let it sit for a little bit. Uh, let the gas settle, the oil settle. And uh, when I get the pressure washer out on this thing, I'm, I'm going to coat this with some non-stick stuff uh, to make it uh, not quite as bad to clean out. So anyway, so I want to show you today, guys. Again, appreciate you watching. Hit that subscribe and that like button. Thanks very much. Okay, yeah, one more quick tip. Uh, when to side shoot versus when to mulch. So when your grass is kind of tall, you haven't been able to keep up with it. Uh, it's a good time to use a side shooter for that. Uh, if not, just mulch it. But it's kind of long right now, so I'm going to try the side shooter out. It's actually broken. I need to get a new one, but it stays in there. So I'm going to side shoot this. Uh, give me an update when I'm done. It's kind of long, actually. So, All right, y'all. To fix these uh, hard clay dried spots, I am going to mix in some potty mix right here and up in some of this mason sand here mix about half and half and then toss this on those crack spots hopefully it'll uh help break that up a little bit and uh let you know how it goes
spots fixed. We'll see how they do. I'll do that one next, but kind of like a leveling job here, but we're trying to break up that cracked clay soil. And I'll water this, see how it goes. So we'll test this out, see if it works. If it does, we'll hit the rest of those spots too. Here's Zach and the foster puppy, say hey. All right, y'all, see ya, thanks. Okay, guys, on the spots I just fixed, I'm gonna uh, spray some of the Simple Lawn Solutions on it. 16.48, just to get those spots going. And a few of those spots I plugged previously are not doing super great, so I'm gonna shoot them with this a little bit and uh, see how it goes. Thanks.